to Power BI tutorial. In previous session, we learned uh, what is import query mode in Power BI desktop and how we can import data from different data sources. Okay, so in today's session, we will learn how we can transform data using Power Query editor. Right, so for this, go to home tab and under home tab, we have one option edit queries. When you click edit queries, one new window will be open from name Power Query editor. As you see here, sample file is my Power BI file name and Power BI Power Query Editor is window name, right? So in my left hand side, you will see four data sets, orders, returns, COVID-19 and countries. So today we will transform COVID-19 data set. So just select COVID-19 data set. See, this is my uh, COVID-19 data set. And here we have nine to 10 columns. See here. Firstly, we will change our column name and we will assign proper column name to our data set. So for this, just double click to column name and give proper name, see country. Okay, fine. So guys, if you noticed, when I change my country, when I change my column name, so my all changes has been tracked under applied step see here rename column and if and now i want to delete unnecessary columns suppose i want to delete last column so we just click and select last column and i want to delete multiple columns so using control key you can select multiple columns suppose i want to delete this one and this one right and now press right click and remove columns so when I click remove columns, this, this action will be tracked under apply step. See, remove column. So till yet I perform two actions. One is rename column and second one is remove column. Okay. So now I want to change my data set data types. Okay. So before this, if you see here, total recovered as you know total recovered is always numeric right but under this column i am getting some text value and forward slash a c so when i change data type it will give me error okay so for this firstly we will replace na to zero okay so for this select column and right click here see replace values To find where NA value to find right here and forward slash A and replace with zero. Okay, so guys, if you see here in ninth number, so just click to OK. See now 20th number NA has been replaced with zero and in ninth number NA has been replaced with zero. Okay, so fine and my this action has been tagged under apply step C rename. So till yet I have performed three actions: remove or rename column, remove columns, and replace value. Fine. And now I want to change my data types. So guys, if you see here, before country name there is ABC icon, and before all column names you will see ABC icon. What is it ABC icon? ABC means this is text. ABC denote to text. Okay. But you know variable total case, new cases, total tax, new tax, all should be in numeric. Okay. So now I will change data type text to numeric. So using control key, I will select multiple columns and it all should be numeric total recover active case seriously critical and total cases okay so i select all columns instead country and just go to transform and click to data types and go to whole numbers see now all data type all columns data types has been successfully changed 
to numeric before total case you can see here 1 2 3 1 2 1 2 3 denote to numeric number right fine and country country column denote to text okay and my action has been tracked under apply this step change time okay guys and now suppose you want to roll back your changes so how you can do that so see here suppose if you see here in first in first action i change my column name see your name column if you want to see your previous changes what was your previous column name so you just go to action under applied steps and just click to cross icon see now i am clicking to cross icon and you want to delete this step yes see my previous changes has been rolled back and now again i want to change my country name so double click to country column name and give it to proper name fine okay so just have a look country and if you see here word is not a country name okay so how we can delete world row so for this just click table icon and i want to delete row from top so remove top rows click and i want to delete only one because what is in top just click ok see now top one row has been removed okay okay guys so that's all about transformation and uh, here we will learn how we can remove columns and how we can rename the columns and how we can replace particular values particular column values and how we can change data types so anytime you can roll back your changes uh, go to apply steps and remove steps totally cross icon okay so thank you guys